What are the steps to building a house? Hello friends, today we will talk that what are the steps to building a house. There are many steps to building a house, from pouring the foundation to framing to choosing your paint colors. This video will show you the process of building a house, so you'll know what to expect each step of the way. 1. Building Site Preparation Once your builder has acquired the appropriate permits, the first step in building a house is to prepare the land. During building site preparation, crews will clear the lot of rocks, debris, or trees. Their goal is to level the site prior to pouring the foundation. 2. Pouring the foundation. Foundations are typically built on slabs, basements, or crawl spaces. They often consist of poured concrete with steel rods. Since concrete isn't waterproof, your contractor will spray it with a waterproofing substance. Civil engineer will examine the foundation before building continues. 3. Framing. During this step, the contractor will install walls, windows, and doors, as well as the floor and roof systems. What's known as the skeleton of your new house is starting to take shape. Your builder will install a protective shield, known as a house wrap, to prevent moisture from affecting the structure, keeping mold and wood rot at bay. 4. Setting up plumbing, electrical and HVAC. Once the house is considered dried in, i.e., covered with the house wrap, it's time to move on to plumbing, electrical, and HVAC systems. After they're installed, an inspector will approve your pipes, electrical wiring, and heating and cooling ducts. The builder will typically schedule wiring installation after the plumbing and HVAC ducts are in place because it's easier for the electrician to work around the other two contractors. 5. Adding insulation. Adding insulation is an important step for controlling a house's temperature and keeping cooling and heating costs low. Foam, fiberglass, and cellulose are common insulation materials. Your contractor will typically insulate exterior walls and areas around a basement, crawl spaces, or attic. 6. Adding drywall. Once the drywall goes up, your house's interior will begin to look complete. Your builder will hang drywall and cover any raised surfaces, like seams or nails, with a spackling compound. They may use a texture spray to add interest to the walls. And finally, a coat of primer. 7. Interior finishes. Once the drywall is in place, your builder will focus on interior finishes, such as the fireplace, mantel, internal doors and windowsills, and decorative trim. You'll finally get to see that paint color you've been agonizing over on the walls. And trust us, it'll look great. 8. Exterior finishes. Driveways, walkways, and patios, oh my! things are really starting to take shape outside your new home too. The builder will complete exterior grading to ensure proper drainage away from the house and make sure your new yard is coming along nicely. 9. Installing fixtures. In this step, your builder will install fixtures, such as light switches and faucets. You'll also see your toilets and sinks added. Your HVAC system is now complete. 10. Installing flooring. Next, your builder will install either hardwood flooring or carpets. When making your selections, consider which is right for you in each room of your home. For example, if you suffer from allergies, hardwood might be the way to go. Your new home will look move-in ready after this step. 11. Inspection. This final inspection, by a building code official, will give you a certificate of occupancy, which means it's time to move in. If there are any problems, they'll schedule a second inspection to confirm the builder corrected the issues. A pro tip for building your house, get an independent inspector as well. 12. Final walkthrough. Also known as a pre-settlement walkthrough, your builder will show you the new home's amenities and cover your responsibilities under warranty. Now is your chance to spot anything you'd like them correct before moving in. Take your time and examine things closely. For example, Check to make sure they've included all of the features you requested and that all of the electrical outlets are working. If you like the video give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For getting more useful and interesting information, subscribe to the engineer Ajay Lodz channel, How to Make My House.